Hey there guys and welcome back to Star Shelter. Now today my focus is this uh, quite constant annoyance which is damage that's um, done to the base through uh, rogue asteroid thingy majiggies. They're really just annoying. So today I want to actually focus on a solution to that and that means like getting some sort of uh, shields up or some kind of defenses up for certain parts of the base. Now yum. this isn't going to be an easy overnight fix. Uh, it's going to take quite a lot of work really. So we're going to just have to do it bit by bit especially as the base is uh, expanding. Uh, it's going to get even more difficult um, to actually manage it all. Now, we've got a couple of options. Got a plasma shield. Um, and something I'm a bit short on is the actual plasma. Uh, that can be crafted. What do I need? Well, I need more biomass for that and uh, more energy cells. Or I can actually put up defense turrets. Now, hmm could actually build two of them now in theory these should as the um, asteroid is approaching they should uh, shoot them on site and take them out in theory whether that actually works or not will be anybody's guess it's been a bit of a bit a uh, bit of a mixed bag on results from that from what I've uh, gathered from other players so what I'm going to do is I'm going to head out, I'm going to install them. Uh, then I could do with more materials to uh, craft up the plasma so I can uh, consider actually getting some shields up. Come on. I'd uh, really like to do more exploring, but uh, as we found in the previous episode, every time I went exploring, something decided it wanted to hit my base. Really quite annoying. I want to get that. That'll uh, give me some useful uh, materials. Come here. Thank you. Alright, let's salvage that. Thank you. Right. Comet shower. Oh, I... <sighs> yeah, of course it is. Where's it coming from? Oh, right there. Whoa. Uh, I think I just got lucky there. Zero collisions. Yeah, come on. Go away. Settle down. Come on. Missing my time. All right, let's salvage these as well because they'll have uh, very useful resources. Thank you. Right. Now, uh, just got to think where am I going to put these uh things now some of the issues that we have i mean i've actually put some stronger walls up so uh the uh, so they can actually take some of the smaller meteorites the problems come with the actual corridors themselves though uh these are very vulnerable and uh they really don't take much before uh, they get wrecked so ooh, uh, back up a bit ah, trying to grab don't like uh, yeah right so you can see there it's actual um, tag team range when I can actually keep still so think put that there that one on that side Whoa. try not to float off into space Dear me, what's going on with me today? And I might actually put one on this side um, because then hopefully any comets coming in at that angle, that trajectory to impacts there, hopefully this would take it out. Well, that's the plan anyway. Arr, come here. Right. So, uh Of uh, say there, 
Now these are actually going to uh, cause drain to the power, so I'll most probably need more solar panels. Uh, check to see if they're activated. I should be able to check them within the uh, main console. A space in for any more materials. Oh yes, I can see another satellite dish floating around there. Ideal materials for what I'm going to need. So that's what I'm looking for. And them satellite dishes actually uh, give a couple of them, as well as uh, some power and other th things. Come here. Oh, oh, oh. Spinning wildly. Keep still. Thank you. Right. Got that. Right, I'm going to head back to base. Going to take a look at the uh, control panel. See how much power this is when they'll be perfectly ideal really come on because they are lit up whether they're actually activated is another question uh, come on let me in oh sod that get the oxygen in there right okay so Toggle defenses. All oh, defenses are on. Okay, let's have it. come over here and see if it does its job. Ah, hang on. It's hard to tell. I didn't hear anything. Can't see anything. But that uh, coming that was on the uh, direct path to the uh, shuttle. It doesn't seem to have impacted. So. I'm assuming they must have worked. Really love these password gates. Brilliant. <laughs> Saves me having to push buttons. Yum yum yum. Right, so uh right, so are you gaining at 0.5 per second at a loss of 0.3? So eh, it's alright at the moment. It's not too bad. Uh but I'm gonna probably need more solar panels just to make sure. Um that keeps building up i could do with also actually getting some more power um box things i forgot what they're called actually what are they called we did actually put one in our new uh engineering room or storage room so let's have a look no not there so interior red shell research construction power station that's the one uh unfortunately i don't have the materials for that what do I need for battery? So, ooh, craft battery. Uh, I need two of them, don't I? What about chips? Well, so I'll do another battery. Chips. Should have enough materials for them as well, I think. So, let's see. On. Still waiting on the ability to queue these up because he's not queuing them. Not properly, anyway. Right. Power station. There we go. So let's get that crafted up. Gonna head up into our. Whoa. What's going on here? Where's that come from? What? <laughs> um, that's not supposed to be there and this one this is doubled up that's what oh i think that's a bit of a bug i'm not going to touch it in case it completely destroys everything but let's head on up here expand our uh, power storage supply i wonder if oxygen's working in this section yet we up Nope. Still can't breathe though. Right. Oxygen stable here. Yeah, we're alright for oxygen here. So, right. Gonna. Oops. Not that one. Right. Interior power station. Let's rotate that round. Hmm. Don't want to install there. That's a shame. Hmm. Fiddle it the placement. 
right put that there so that'll expand on our uh, power storage in more so while the solar panels are gener uh, generating electricity it'll uh, store it up be good for the uh, defense turrets but oh, dear with me right let's sort my health out now right head on down and I will uh, be wanting to expand on the base. Um, I'm still after uh, constructing. Uh -oh. Still after constructing that hollow deck thing uh, because that'll actually give us a 3D map of the environment around us. So we'll be able to actually get a better idea of what's going on out there. So, all right. Oh, that's better. That's definitely a useful gadget. Right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to head on out because I'd like to get the materials together to craft a uh, plasma shield or two for the actual rooms. So let's have a look. Um, what do I need? So I'm going to need plasma, metal, chips and oil. So I've got a bit of scavenging to do. Well, that could be an ideal time for me to actually explore the ship I see below. Oop. Err. I'm going to contain that. Thank you. Right. Okay, so I'm going to head down to that ship down there. And yeah. Back in a moment, guys. Okay, here we are, guys. This is one of those... Um, Ships has got biomass for days. Shut up. Right. And salvage that. Come on. Yes, Impact thank you. Averted. Yes. I'm wondering if that, that could actually be my defense turrets doing the job. It should be good. Are there any more of them weird robotic things i think there's one over there can't see any over here right let's have a look over here visor. oh ah! what where are they where's that one you can see that one over there What's this other one? Oh. Oh, shoot. Your gun with modifiers. They can be found by scavenging the spaceships. Yes. I haven't found any yet, so. Alright, that's that one. Is there another one around? There it is. All right. Let's uh, just have a quick look at this. Shut up. Because I don't really want to be using all my power up. All right. There's a couple of uh, consoles there that I could salvage. But yeah, I could get plenty of biomass from here. Let's hack this panel and see what we can find up there. All right. So... That turns them, that turns that, that turns all of them. Right. Oop. Ah, crap. There we go. Right, activate. Let's just uh, go straight up. Right, what have we got here? So we've got a locker cord. Oop. Ah! Come here. That power thing's stuck in there. Right. That'll be useful. Lock a cord, so I'll put that in there. I'm not too sure where we're going to use it. This safe can't seem to uh Oh well, yeah you can. Alright. Back backspace. Backspace. Right, so let's have a look at that cord. Uh, uh. B four six two. Keep still. Three, 
four, six. No! Two. Is it open? Ah, oh, come on. Not open properly. Right, so we've got a shield. Yes, that's good. Ooh, goodies. Um, got split shot for the gun. Put that on there. Lovely. Let's just uh, restock that. Put that in there. Not going to waste uh, my power. Right, two shields. Ooh. Let's have that. Some oxygen. That in there. Yum. Ugh. Yum. Alright, let's have that. Okay, is there anything else around here? I think that's probably the most valuable thing in this part. Can I salvage that? Yes, I can. Alright, so I've got some biomass from there. Don't really need glass. Let's uh, head over here. Okay. How are we doing? Ooh, not much power left. Right. Tell you what, let's get the shield out. Ah! That's a bit weird that you can't seem to uh, grab when you've uh, got your inventory open. Ha! Come in for ya. Got ya. Yeah, that works nicely, that shield. So is that. Yeah, that's a good deal, that shield. Definitely uh, find that a good use for that. Now, I'm a bit run out of power, so really would like to come back here because the biomass is what I do need and there's plenty of it in here. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to head out, back out, and I'm going to get some more uh, power so I can do some more salvaging. Yeah, be right back, guys. We're back, guys. So I managed to get some more power. Um, I had a comet shower on my base, and yeah, it seems like uh, the defense turrets are doing their job, actually, which is a good thing. Really quite pleased about it. Um, you can actually see them actually doing anything but the comet that was heading directly towards my base actually missed so they must be doing their job so so it's that right see what it's probably not really worth it to uh, go in there i'll get, get electronics from uh, those i think they're monitors over there other than that, though, not a lot, and it's going to cost me 15 power, which means that if we get in there, I'm going to be out of power again anyway. So, what I may as well do is just salvage what I can from here. And what should we got? 13. So, let's see that. Yeah, there we go. I'm out of power now. Oh, I can see another one of the defense turrets there, so. It's not spotted me, so never mind. Right, so I've got to head up to the base, uh, have a look, see what I can actually do now, because I'm getting a bit full on my uh, resource inventory. Really do with that being expanded, actually, which is well, um, I need to keep my eyes open. Uh, well, that way, uh, keep my eyes open for an actual another ship and there is that base over there um at one of them terminal things and i'll be able to get some experience points Incoming. oh come off it where's it coming from oh right yeah oh crap oh my word get lost Oh, you and me. Took a bit of a battery in there. All right. I'll live. 
All right, let's get back up there and uh, yeah, see if I can actually uh, put up a couple of plasma shields. I can roll them up. All right, guys. So I've got enough materials to craft a plasma shield for now. So I'm going to get that crafted up. Uh, need quite a bit more resources uh, to do some more plasmas. That actually, takes up. Ah, come on. Control's going a bit wacky. Oxygen what? Is what? Are you kidding me? I actually got attacked by a drone while inside my base. How the beeping hell did it see me? Oh, honestly. Mmm. All right. Oh, never mind that. Yeah. So I need actually I need a lot more biomass. Actually, have I got some power in storage here? I'm not too sure if I have actually. I think I've got oxygen. I've got got one. Come here. You go there. You come here. Let's put that in my inventory. Oop. Keep still. Let's take that out. Put that in there. Don't even need that lock cord anymore. Never mind. Throw that into the uh, wilderness of space. And uh, yeah, I think we'll put out the first um, defense shield. Uh, I'm a bit concerned about the corridor section over there, the uh, C corridor. So I'd like to see how much coverage you'll offer. So let's head out here. Right, let's have a look. Mm, it might actually be better if I had a defense turret on that, but let's just uh, see what what's what. So, structures, no. Defense, that's it. Yeah, that doesn't give me an indication of um, how much coverage it'll have. Let's put it on. Oop. All right, that'll cover that section. So there's still plenty that it could actually hit. I thought it might be a bit uh, taller than that, but unfortunately not. But never mind. Not, um, anything going straight for that part will bounce off the shield, which is a good thing. Um, so, yeah, I've got quite a lot of work, and it's only going to get more complex as the base expands. Well, I think uh, that's all we've got time for today. Um, what I'll be, uh, be doing off camera, I'll gather more resources. Um, and then we'll consider about how we're going to expand the base even further. I want to get that holographic room uh, constructed. And uh, yeah, have a look, see what else there is to actually build up. But progress, we're making progress. We've got extra uh, power storage. Uh, we've got a couple of defenses up on the base now. So hopefully uh, it won't be such a big problem when I'm adventuring. And I'll actually be able to do things without worrying about my base falling apart while I'm away. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you smash the like button. Blah, 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 blah. Can't speak. Make sure you smash that like button. Hit subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.